Hi Taurus, it's Power and Light Tarot coming at you with the reading. This is going to be behind the scenes on your person, Taurus. So this is going to be their personal reading. Yes, it is. And uh, you could be showing up here. And this reading could even be yours because, you know, when we do these readings, uh, sometimes the energies can be, right, this could be, uh, this could be your energy too, okay, because they're general readings. All right, so let's see what we have for your person, if that kind of makes any sense. And let's put Buddha back because Buddha... Uh, Buddha had a neck ache, you guys. Yeah, <laughs> it's because I dropped it. And <laughs> yeah, that's kind of what happened. So let's put these back here. And uh, yeah, let's see what we have for uh, Taurus and their person. And let's go ahead and get some cards. We'll get a couple cards from Lenormand. You know, just kind of keep this. We're going to kind of keep things a little bit different here. This is how we do it uh, from the last video, right? The last. Uh, the last video I've done, which uh, I'm not really sure who's uh, what sign that was for. Let's see what we have for Taurus. Yeah, Taurus's person. All right, bless their heart, whoever they are. Hopefully, they're you know kind of worth blessing or mentioning that. Let's see what we got uh, <laughs> for Taurus's person, and we have the mask. Okay, the storm, the ship. And the house. Okay, so for me, right away, there could be deception here, or your person, it could be maybe, they could be wearing a facade too, right? Where trying to kind of act like they're happy if they're not, or maybe, you know, putting on some type of a face when they really mean something else. That could definitely be uh, the case. And the storm, they could be in a storm here, or they could be dealing with a situation maybe where they are like, uh, their judgment is clouded, maybe by deception, could be. Um, but they have, they also have the ship. For me, this is about a journey or somebody's at a distance, right? It could be, all right. Or maybe there's a situation that is about somebody at a distance or just something like that. And the house, we know the house is a union, right? It is about a relationship. Unless you are a construction person, then, you know, maybe it's about that <laughs> or your person. So let's see what we have for Taurus's person. And we're going to move these cards right here. And I'm going to include a link uh, below. It's an astrology uh, video by a great astrologer. Yes, I watch them all the time. Joseph P. Anthony. And it is about the Sagittarian Eclipse and also the galactic kind of... Uh, uh, maybe awakening sort of but the energy that is coming through on the 14th and it is also about something that you guys really need to know and uh, the at the 34 minute mark you uh, will hear that and please don't ever come back here if you don't like the video or you don't agree with him or something like that no need to make any comments about it all right it is a way to enlighten yourself about things okay and you don't have to agree with it of course not so let's get into the uh the reading and uh fascinating video so let's see what we have for taurus's person and their energy is the knight of wands taurus you know you've been dealing with a fire sign some of you and we have the ten of wands are carrying a burden uh, about some change here and in the recent past they have the king of wands this is what i mean about a fire sign your person, what's on their mind is the Emperor. They could be Aries. And let's see, I have their desire over here. Uh, yes, I do, which we're going to talk about uh, in the other video, in the extended, right? And uh, we're going to mention many more things, of course. And uh, let's see what we have. Your person right now, they're carrying a, a heavy load about something for us. It has to do with change. Maybe you are kind of giving them, you could be maybe giving them the boot, right? You could be. Uh, that's not a nice way to say it, but, you know, could be. So let's see what we have, or somebody is, because uh, they are really sad over here in the near future. They're grieving. This is grieving a sad ending. Yeah, mm-hmm. So let's see what we have. Maybe they have uh, done something in your relationship and you're letting them go, maybe. Their concern is a passionate new beginning over here. I feel like that is uh, one uh, a passionate new beginning that is kind of out of their reach, possibly, right? That's why they're grieving. So 
So let's see here. The Knight of Wands, kind of coupled here with the Ten of Wands. Why is that Knight of Wands there? Six of Swords, they're carrying a burden. Oh, sorry, they are leaving. Six of Swords, your person feels frustrated or they feel maybe stressed out, maybe just unhappy. They want to leave a situation here. Yeah, they do. And uh, I, they want to leave because it's a major burden to them. And they could be leaving right now. I feel like they look like they're leaving now because they're carrying this burden. Yeah, I feel like they are. Seven of Pentacles, this man is walking away. Let's see what the burden could be. Page of Swords. Okay, and uh, they could be thinking that, like, they could, I feel like it has to do with your person is like kind of fearing some change here. So they they could be leaving, right? I'm just going to leave because this is, you know, X, Y, and Z is going to happen. And I'm not going to sit here and wait, you know, wait till the ninth hour and then, you know, boom. So let's look at the root for them. Because they're in the Page of Swords energy, right? I'm dwelling on it. I'm thinking about it. Sometimes it is, you know, spying and anything to do with communication but in this uh it looks like they are dwelling on a situation and they like they're still thinking about it like yeah i feel like this is going to happen to me change two of cups because of a union here because of two people who want to be together uh yeah that's usually what the two of cups is two people who could be in love with each other your person i feel like they're walking away because <clears throat> they're carrying a burden here. They think there's a third party here. I feel like that's exactly what's going on here. Taurus, your person thinks that like you are uh, in love with someone else, it seems. Okay? Or interested in somebody else that could be really, you know, interested in somebody else. Like majorly interested, right? Yeah. King of Wands in the past. Three of Cups reversed. It could be uh, a third party ended. They could be unhappy here. Three of Cups reversed, right? Yeah. And the Ace of Pentacles. I feel like they were unhappy about some type of a new beginning that you want. And this energy could be showing up, Taurus, because they think you're going to reunite with somebody. Or this third party is affecting them, like, negatively. Okay? Well, they all do, right? Yeah. So let's look at the Emperor here, please. And if there's no active third party, not everybody's in one, your person just thinks that you want this other person. Maybe you haven't, you know, maybe you haven't, like, uh, like really done anything or actually left or, you know, you've partaken or uh, in uh, a third party situation. And, you know, looking at your person's Lenormand cards, look, they are, they're in a storm here about their union. Yeah, they are. Uh, there could be about somebody from the past and about this deception with the mask. Yeah, interesting how those four cards just kind of like fit right in, right? The Emperor is what's on their mind, Taurus. The Star card and the World card reverse. So they think you have unfinished business with somebody else. And for some of you guys, it's possible here your person is doing this themselves, right? They could feel that. They can't be in two relationships, maybe. It's a major burden to them, so they have to leave to, you know, find peace because it could be kind of tumultuous for them uh, to be in two relationships. That could be the case. They could be the one wearing the mask, right? So these readings are general. It's kind of like, yeah, it's just like that. Mm-hmm. It's kind of like when you go to Latin America, you know, a lot of the countries have uh, pan, de pan de dulce, I think, pan dulce is what it is. It's just like, uh, it's just a little bun kind of, a little piece of bread kind of, that is, you know, it kind of has a little bit of sugar to it. Yeah, it's really what it is, uh, you know, and so, but they all have their own versions, pan dulce, mm -hmm, which means sweet bread. So this is kind of like this. That's, I mean, these in general readings, and that's what I mean, okay? So let's look over here. I hope you guys like my analogy, all right? <laughs> let's look over here, you guys. <laughs> Three major arcana, what's on your person's mind, all right? Yeah, your person, right now, this is a major storm for them, right? With hailstones and, you know, 
you know, a big piece of snow hitting them in the head and, you know, uh, the lake is over, the lake is flooding because of the rain, the torrential rain. I mean, you're a poor person, right? Yeah, I feel like it is. So this, uh, you know, what's on their mind is I feel like, you know, you taking action to heal the situation with somebody else. That's how that looks there. Mm -hmm. And there also could be an Aries in this reading, right? The Emperor and the King of Wands. Let's look at their near future. They're grieving. They're, uh, I feel like they could be making a sad decision. I feel like that's what that is. Right? Or they're grieving because of a decision you're making. But your person, I feel like, is trying to make a decision. I feel like they are. Yeah. They're, I feel like they're making a decision. Uh, they're thinking of making the decision here to leave. Yeah. I don't think they've left yet. But, you know, for some of you guys, it could have happened. Right? Because, again, these are general and they're timeless. Yeah, they are, guys. Yeah. So, I mean, this, this reading, you know, could have happened in the fourth grade, okay? <laughs> no, it's not that timeless, all right? <laughs> OMG. And the, the Empress is showing up. Yeah, this is all about a third-party Empress, okay? And so far, who's in the reading is potentially Aquarius, Aries, Scorpio, Leo, Sagittarius, and Gemini, Aquarius, or Libra. Yeah, all these people here. Mm -hmm. And Taurus as well with the Empress. So let's look at their concern, which is the Ace of Wands. With the Queen of Wands reversed. For me, your person looks like they're a fire sign. Yeah, they do. The King and the Queen are both here. They're trying to fight their fears, right? About a passionate new beginning. So it's unlikely they have one, but they could. It looks like you have a passionate new opportunity with somebody else. Yeah, and in their in the root for them, sorry guys, in the environment for them is the Knight of Swords and the Page of Pentacles and the Seven of Cups. Yeah, for me, your person uh, in their environment is, they feel like they're getting cut out here because maybe you have options. They could be confused, but... This can also be making them making a really hard choice to leave because you are, and I feel like it is, because you have somebody else. So we're going to find out all about your person. Yeah, we have our detective cap on. Yes, we do, Taurus. Yeah, we do. We wear it well. It fits well. It's not generic. And it was made in the United States. What do you think about that? <laughs> That's what we have to do. We have to try to support this country, you guys. Don't forget about, don't forget the video link I put uh, down below regarding astrology. It's really important, guys. It's about stuff that is like, especially at the 34-minute mark, okay? Remember never to make any comments. I appreciate you guys. I care. And we're going to go over to uh, the extended, and we're going to see all about your person, what they really want, how they feel, Taurus, what they need, or what, be, or what may be most important to them. Yeah, it's not always love. Sometimes it is peace of mind, maybe, something like that. The block for them, what they hide, and their future. They're all super affordable. And please remember to like, share, and subscribe. All right. Thank you so much, you guys.